To do this, we just need our MacBooks and a smart TV. So not a regular TV, but a smart TV. And both have to be connected to the same Wi-Fi network. After that, we'll select the settings widget and then select stream mirroring. Now, if you get here and you see this, you don't see anything at all. This means you either don't have a smart TV or your smart TV isn't connected to your internet, your Wi-Fi. In my case, I just recently changed the password to my Wi-Fi, so I had to reconnect my Wi-Fi, my internet, to my TV again. But once I did that, go back to the set widget, go to stream mirroring, and voila. So everything is here. So this works with your Apple TVs or any other compatible devices as well. But once you select your option that you're seeing, so in my case, my Samsung 7 Series TV, it'll connect right away. That's pretty much it, but I'm going to leave you with one more tip. Still on your computer, your MacBook, go to Display Preferences, and then select the Display Settings option. From here, you can turn off the mirroring option, and you can also change the output, the display output. So you can set it where it's tailored to your TV, where it's full screen, or you can set it where it's tailored to your laptop, where you kind of just have the borders missing. I'll show you in a, in a second. So something like this. So that's the display tailored to the MacBook itself. All right, that's all I got for you. Much love to each and every one of you. I'm your downloading pirate, and I'm out. I'm out.